what's going on guys moxification here so today i bring you uh, a video on uh how i record my uh screen like my computer screen so you see my screen right now i could go on the internet i could open up my pvr i could you know do whatever open up neighborhood not that it's going to connect because my jtag is not on but uh the point is uh how to record your screen so what you're going to do is you're going to go on the internet you're going to download um in fact you're go you're going to type in uh, hypercam uh, i use hypercam you just like google hypercam it'll be the first website it'll, it's called like hyperonics or something uh i don't know what that is to be honest there you are yeah hyperonics there you are uh and it's i think it's hyperonics but yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce it. I think it's Hyperonics, but yeah, I'm not sure. But yeah, you just download it. It's like, it's free. You know, you don't have to pay for it. It's really easy to download. If you go to download Hypercam here, you've got uh, you've got two 32-bit um, like downloads. So like if you've got a 32-bit computer, then you can download one of them. Like you do server one or server two. And then if you've got a 64-bit, which I do, you download this one. Uh, so yeah, make sure you get that right. And if if you don't know what yours is, you just go to computer, right click and go to properties, and it will bring up your stuff. And then mine is sixty four. There you go. It'll be sixty four bit operating system. Uh, and then you'll know. Uh, so then from there, once you downloaded it and like set it all up and installed it, it will look like this. This is what I'm using currently to record. Uh, you've got your screen area, so you select resolution. It's kind of like a, a Giazzo screenshot, you know. Uh, it, you basically drag it from here to there or there or wherever else. Or if you just want to do it like there, then you could. Um, and then uh, you get the hotkeys. Um, you've got start recording, stop recording, which is uh, F2. Or you can click start record or stop record like right there. You've also got pause, record, play, defaults, and help. Um, and then you've got other stuff, you know, uh, pause and resume, uh, hotkey, and single frame shot. I don't know what that is. I haven't tried it yet. I think it's probably just like a a, uh, a screenshot. Uh, AVI, you can actually change the... Um, I forget what it's called. Uh, you can change the file type and stuff. And you can make it, and then uh, the file. This is the file they made because it goes to my desktop automatically. Um, because I've set it to go there, and it's there right now. Um, and then you've got a load of other stuff. You've got sound. You can change the microphone. I use my Turtle Beach to, you know, do this. Uh, and then you've got all of the other stuff. Stuff that I don't need to change because it's already done. Um, options. You can make it, so then when you click on something. It actually makes like a starburst effect, like not an not an insane effect, just so you know what I clicked on, basically, so you can locate the mouse easier. You guys, not me, it does it for you guys, like so it does it over the video, uh, and then a licensing stuff which isn't needed to be shown. But yeah, so you can download it free; it's fully free, and I'm not I'm not advertising or anything. It's just people wanted to know what I used to record my screen. So yeah, that's sort of how to do it but you, you need to you know set it up and i'm not going to show you the full setup because i don't have anything else to record my screen um to show you the setup you know because i'd have to use hypercam if that makes sense uh, unless i've got like a virtual machine and then did it you know over like you know through that but yeah uh i think that's the only other way i could do it but yeah so that's it that's the the download will be in the description you can just download it or you can also go on google and type in uh hypercam and then you can download it yourself uh from the website but yeah so if anyone has any trouble uh you can ask me but if normally because you know it's not my program i, I never made it i didn't um i don't know the people that made it uh it's just like a, a normal thing i'd recommend taking it to them if if you have any you know trouble with it but me uh it's been fine i've had it for a long time many years actually probably like two years but yeah that's it thanks guys moxification and i will see you guys in the next video uh a goodbye